Hello everybody! In this video I'll tell you how to use Reg Organizer to speed up a Windows operating desktop computer or laptop. Hello friends! If you need to recover deleted data, view or restore removed browsing history, Hetman Software Products will help you. Follow the link in the description, download the necessary program for free, install it and analyze the disk. The utility will show you the data you can recover, so you'll be able to view it or get it back. In our channel and blog you will find solutions to any problem, from installing an operating system or configuring it to fixing possible bugs and errors or optimizing mobile gadgets. Our specialists will answer any questions you ask in your comments under the videos or articles. This program has a good set of functions including cleaning the system from junk files, optimizing the registry, checking it for errors and correcting them, defragmenting the registry, managing startup items to control the applications starting with the operating system and lots of other useful options. By using this utility, you'll be able to optimize and speed up your operating system and free up more resources to make your PC work faster. Now, let's go into details of every feature to speed up your computer or laptop. The first one on the list is the Express Check. When you click on it, the program will quickly check the system and show you the brief information on its current status, namely, how much resources can be freed up and how many programs from the startup can be optimized how much private data and what elements of that can be cleaned up, and how many uninstalled programs still have some junk files left. You can choose the item you are interested in or move on to another item in the left-hand menu. In the section Freeing disk space and correcting problems, you can scan the system to get more detailed information on how much space can be freed up from junk, with cleanup locations shown for your convenience. After clicking on Cleanup, the process starts. Its duration depends on how much junk is there on your computer. When the cleaning is over, a message appears to tell you it's complete and to show how much space was freed. After clicking OK, you'll see the main screen of the program saying that no cleanup is required now. OK, you've just completed one of the things needed to speed up your computer. The system has been cleaned from junk files and your system disk has more free space now, which can improve its performance, especially if you haven't cleaned the computer from junk for a long time. Private Data Cleanup cleans the browsing history and application's cache and it lets you clean all browsing history, cache of all programs you have on your computer, the list of recently used applications, obsolete downloads, and so on. If you check the box next to cookies and website data in a specific browser, the utility will delete all passwords and autofill data recorded by such browser. Hit Clean Up to start the process. Now, another step for optimizing your system is complete. The next feature is Registry Optimization. It will boost your system performance. In the course of its work, registry files will be compressed and defragmented if necessary. Click on Perform Registry Optimization and the utility starts working. When it's over, you'll see how much the registry size was reduced, how it looked like before and after optimization. And you'll see a warning saying that the system should be restarted to complete the process. The system will restart automatically. After this window is closed, close it and the system restarts at once. The next set of functions is meant for advanced users only, so if you're not sure what you're doing, you'd better don't change them. Startup applications. Here you will see the list of programs started automatically when the system boots or a user signs in. The program name Commands, and in the last column you can see how many users disabled the program, the left line, or delayed it, the right line. Clicking on a program, you can delay its start for some time, disable it temporarily, or remove it from the startup list if you don't use it at all or need it very rarely. At the bottom of the page, you can see that the system boot can be optimized by delaying the load of some applications. Click here to optimize, and beginning with the next boot, the specified programs will start with a delay. With this function, 
Software installing and uninstalling, you can not only remove a program and clean all of the junk files it might have left behind, but also find tracks of the applications that were uninstalled some time ago, and clean them up as well. When you hit the button, it starts the search, and when it's over, you'll see the list of previously deleted programs that left behind some junk files or invalid registry lines. You can view all this information in detail, and if you don't need all those files, just clean them up by clicking Remove Leftovers. It's very convenient that you can remove several programs at once by checking their boxes and clicking Uninstall. And another function, Install an application, lets you monitor all the changes taking place in the system while a new piece of software is being installed. Later on, you can use this received data to remove the program completely and correctly by cancelling all the changes it has made to your system. The next function is the Registry Editor. It's the same application that is built into the operating system, so I won't be going into details. In our channel, there are several videos about dealing with the registry, so if you're interested, you can watch them by following the links in the description as usual. The next function, Important Registry Parts, will show you various registry parts and, on the right, all detected errors. Below you will see the exact number of erroneous entries, which you can remove by clicking on this button. Tweaks. This is where you can configure system settings in a single click. While these options are usually hidden or hard to find in the standard system interface, this function lets you do it in one move. Changes in the settings will not make much difference for high-performance computers, but they can significantly boost weaker machines. In the Quick Tune-Up group, you can apply optimal system settings in a single click and boost your PC performance. If you go for Manually change the various tweaks, you'll be able to enable or disable all tweaks on the list by clicking on an item and choosing On or Off. The third option is to create your own tweak and enable or disable it when necessary. If configured correctly, this option lets the system boot and shut down quicker and perform better thanks to optimization and disabling unnecessary functions. When you click on an item and select On, you'll see a warning that this group is enabled and you have to restart your computer for the changes to take effect. In the section Register Snapshots, you can take a snapshot of the registry and later compare the previous and the current conditions to see all the changes. In fact, this function can be very useful to track changes when you're looking for viruses in the registry and trying to remove them. Uh, there are many useful videos about dealing with viruses in our channel, and you can find all the links in the description. Of course, you can do it all without this program, but it requires good knowledge of how computers work. On the contrary, this utility has all the functions put together, and you don't have to look for every setting just started. Have a look at the system status and optimize it if necessary to boost your computer's performance. And that is all for now. Hit the like button and subscribe to our channel. Leave comments to ask questions. Thank you for watching and good luck.